its world. Once upon a sunny morning by the sandy shore, there lived a curious girl named Lila. Lila loved collecting seashells, big ones, small ones, and even the ones that whispered secrets. One day, while building a sandcastle, Lila found a sparkling pink seashell. It was unlike any she'd seen before. When she held it to her ear, she heard a tiny voice say, Hello, adventurer. Lila's eyes widened. are you? I am Shelly. Rub me three times and I'll take you on an underwater adventure. Lila hesitated but then gave Shelly three gentle rubs. Suddenly, the sand beneath her feet turned into water, and she plunged into the ocean. Down, down she went, surrounded by colorful fish, swirling seaweed, and glistening coral. Shelly led her to the Coral Castle, where the Coral Queen awaited. The Coral Queen had a crown made of pearls and a smile as bright as the sun. Welcome, Lila. You're here to solve a mystery. Lila blinked. A mystery? Yes. The Lost Mermaid song has vanished. Without it, the sea creatures are sad and the waves don't dance. How can I help? Find the golden conch. It holds the song, but beware, the giant seahorse guards it. Lila swam deeper, past schools of fish and through underwater caves. And there it was, the golden conch resting on a bed of glittering sand.
the giant seahorse blocked her way. Its eyes glowed like lanterns. Who dares disturb my treasure? Lila gulped. I'm Lila, and I want the Lost Mermaid song. The giant seahorse frowned. Answer my riddle. What has a tail but no legs? Lila thought hard. A starfish! The giant seahorse smiled. Correct! Take the golden conch. Lila grabbed the conch. And blew into it. The most beautiful melody filled the ocean. The Lost Mermaid Song. The fish twirled, the seaweed swayed, and the waves danced. Back at the Coral Castle, the Coral Queen praised Lila. You've saved our world, little adventurer. Lila returned to the shore, still clutching Shelly. As she stepped onto the sand, it turned back into land. She looked at the sparkling pink seashell. Thank you, Shelly. And from that day on, Lila knew that magic existed in the tiniest things, the seashells, the riddles, and the songs of the sea. And so, dear adventurers, remember to listen to the whispers of shells and let your curiosity lead you to magical places.